1.6 part 2 fractions subtracting. Subtracting fractions is like adding fractions. You need a common denominator. You just subtract instead. 2 over 3 minus 4 over 7. The common denominator equals 21. 3 times 7 is 21. So the fraction on the left had a 3, so we need to multiply by 7 to get 21. So multiply 2 over 3 times 7 over 7. 7 times 2 is 14. 7 times 3 is 21. Now let's look at the 4 over 7 from the right side. It has a 7 on bottom. We need to times by 3 to get 21. So multiply top and bottom by 3. 3 over 3 times 4 over 7 is 12 over 21. Now 14 over 21 minus 12 over 21 equals 2 over 21. 3 over 5 minus 2 over 3. Common denominator, 5 times 3 is 15. So the fraction on the left has a 5, so we need to multiply by 3 to get 15. So multiply it by 3 over 3. 3 times 3, 9. 3 times 5, 15. Remember, straight across. The fraction on the right had a 3, so we need to multiply it by 5 to get 15. So multiply top and bottom by 5. Top and bottom, multiply by 5. So on top, 5 times 2 is 10. 5 times 3 on bottom is 15. 9 minus 10 would be negative 1 over 15. Negative 4 over 5 minus 9 over 10. 10 would be your common denominator because 5 and 10 can go into 10. So the fraction on the left has a 5 on bottom, so we need to multiply it by 2 to get 10. So 2 over 2 times negative 4 over 5 is negative 8 over 10. Minus 9 over 10 was already over 10, so we don't have to do anything to it. Minus 8 minus 9 is minus 17 over 10. 3 over 4 minus 1 over 2. Both of those can go into 4. 2 goes into 4. So the 3 over 4 stays. 1 over 2, you need to multiply it by 2 to get 4. So multiply 1 over 2 times 2 over 2. And you get 2 over 4. 3 over 4 minus 2 over 4 equals 1 over 4. That's the end.